Mick, I've been uh, reliably informed this is the fastest that you've ever swum at a, at a British Championship. So you must be really confident at this stage. Yeah, definitely. The 400 early in the week, I did the same, roughly the same time as what I did last trials. So I kind of hoped I'd go a little bit quicker just to show that I'm on the right path, I'm improving. I think every swimmer strives to kind of keep improving. And for the past four years, I've been roughly on the same times for everything. So I want to step it on. I want to know of how I can improve. I'm always finding ways to improve. That's part and parcel of our job. And I think for me, I'm so pleased that I went two seconds quicker than I did last trials and kind of sets me up kind of going into the next cycle and hopefully can improve on that at the games as well. Arguably, you went into this race with the pressure off to a certain extent. You already had your Olympic spot, but the 800 is your event. You were never going to take it lightly, were you? No, I was more nervous for this than I was the 400, and I have no idea where I was just walking around panicked. I was just like, oh my god. I think it is because it is the event that I love. It's my event, and I just so want to do well in this. This is the event that means more to me, and kind of, I love doing the 400 because it's half of that amount and it's not as painful, but. The 800 is the one I've always done. I so wanted to do well in that. And like I said earlier, I wanted to kind of improve a little bit from the time I did last year. And that's why I just went for it. I kind of didn't focus on kind of the other girls. I stuck to my own race plan. And that's what you've got to do. Did you realise just how fast you were swimming? No, not all. Honestly, you have no idea. But the weird thing was, you could hear the commentators under the pool. And we all stopped them. It was like, that was weird. We did not, I didn't like that. Like, I kept hearing my name at the turns. And I was like, what does that mean? And I was like, it was kind of freaking me out that you could hear the commentators. I've never been to a pool where you can hear the commentary underneath the pool before so I think that all kind of scares us I was more focused on that like <laughs> am I going quick I was trying to listen out <laughs> was that a distraction then but you must have I been. didn't like that no I didn't like it being able to hear other people's voice it felt very very weird and never experienced that before <laughs> thank you <laughs>